Hey, what's up guys? This is Rick with Techspin. Today we've got some products to help you with your desk organization. So I'd like to introduce the John's Bow and they have a monitor standout, which is a GA-01. And this is a tempered glass unit. And this will sit underneath your monitor and has enough space for your keyboard. Uh, along with the John's Bow, uh, I'll be showing off the Sadie's Blade Mail in the review. You'll see it underneath the uh, unit here. I'm gonna do a separate review of this a little bit later on. So let's get to it. This is the Johnsbo GA01 monitor stand, and it's made from machined aluminum and a very nice, thick, tempered glass sheet. It also comes with an LED light, which lights up the entire unit. The unit itself is 53 centimeters long and 21 centimeters wide, and it fits keyboards up to 47 and a half centimeters. It also has a weight support of up to 50 kilograms. It weighs in at 2.7 kilograms. All right, let's take this puppy out of the box. The monitor is bracketed by two nice foam pieces which cover either end and help to protect it during transport. It also comes with a white box and inside the white box will be the feet for the unit. They also provide some ties so you can tie down your cords or put them together for easy cable management. I have to be careful as I take off the plastic here as I wanna be careful and not put too many fingerprints on the glass. You can see the main unit here. I haven't put on the feet yet. just wanted to give you a quick overview. And you can see the nice thick tempered glass panel as well as the nice crafting. And over on the right hand side, we have the two USB 3.0 ports. These USB 3.0 ports are recessed about one inch or 2.5 centimeters. Measuring the length of the cable, it measures up to 122 centimeters. The unit connects with two USB 3.0 pass-throughs as well as a USB 2.0 for powering the white LED light. Johnsbo has put in their logo here in the bottom left hand corner and it fits in well with their unit. I used my measuring tape here and the unit is 52 centimeters wide. Next we have the machined aluminum feet. They screw easily into the bottom of the unit and it's a solid foot and comes with a rubber pad on the bottom which allows the monitor stand to grip the surface it's on. I've plugged in the unit and you can see the Sadie's Blade Mail 104 key keyboard sitting below the shelf. The LED illumination is very nice and really prominent on the sides and front. And the John's Bow logo is illuminated by those LEDs. I turned off the lights to give you an idea what it will look like at night. And here you can see the John's Bow monitor stand nicely illuminating the work area. If you're wondering, the Sadie's Blade Mail is flickering slightly as it's on breathe mode and the shutter speed is causing that effect. All right, so should you spend your money on the John's Bow LED monitor stand? For me, I haven't really used monitor stands before. Uh, just never really thought about it. But actually after using it for a while, I really appreciated how the monitor was up and a little better in position. I didn't have to look down so much to you know, relieve the neck strain. And uh, also the LED lighting effect really lit up my workstation area. I really liked that, that effect. It was really great. Um, the unit itself is really solid too, you know, with uh, the thick tempered glass that can hold up to 50 kilograms. So it can support a lot of different monitors. And, you know, keyboards fit right underneath, which is great. Even uh, a long 104 key keyboard like this Sadie's Blade Mail here. So should you buy this? Um, yeah, you should. <laughs> it's really awesome. And um, I'm gonna give this, I'm gonna end up giving this a nine on the meter, just cause it, it's really, it adds so much to my workspace. I really like it. Um, yeah. Um, also, I'm gonna end up giving this a TechSpin Prime Award for amazing features because it's one of the first in this class that does all this, including the USB 3.0, which is a great selling point for me. I'm always hunting in the back of my computer, you know, chassis to try and plug it in unless you have already bought an extension cable and you can plug it in up top. So yeah, I really like the features on this. This is really nice and convenient and uh, had, it adds a nice aesthetic to your room. Okay, so if this review didn't do it for you, you know what to do. Uh, if, if you did like this review, then please do give it a thumbs up. 
And if you want to see more videos like this, then please do subscribe for new content and click that bell icon to get notified when I put up a new video. I do read the comments, so if you have a question or if I did miss something, then please do let me know down below. And tell me what you'd like to see next. And thank you very much for watching and see you all again really soon. Bye for now.